Hey Super Awesome Stampers, this is Super Awesome Stamper Shirley. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator. Today I would like to share this card. It was a wow demonstration at my sister's party last weekend. She sent me a Pinterest pin that used our heart laser heart um, note cards that we had a couple years ago. So I based, this card is based off of that. So I'm just going to share the products that I used. So the Bloomin' Heart Thinlet was cut with our shimmery white cardstock. Now I'm sure you can't see it on the light, but the shimmery white is a heavier weight. It has a nice little shimmery glittery look to it without the mess of glitter. So it's a great option for a card base and to add a little wow. Um, the next thing, actually I'm going to pull these back in and I'm going to show you that these two also come in with the set. So I've got two large here and one there. I could also roll or two more through and do that. So I have two videos where I show how to pop those chads out of here. So check the other videos for that. I'll open this up and you'll see that this is texturized with the lovely lace embossing folder. So it adds another nice detail. Behind our white seam binding ribbon is the Sweetheart Punch kind of anchors the bow and the vintage faceted button on there. So that's punched in Whisper White. Vintage faceted buttons come in three different sizes. I use, use the largest size. And if you look right there, I used our Hearts Border Punch. Punched one out of the scrap that I created when I cut the heart out. And put a heart over the buttonhole so I didn't have to worry about thread there. Uh, the cardstock is real red. I usually cut it at f um, four by five and a quarter. And then I want to point out the designer series paper strip right there is from the Merry Moments designer series paper. It's this pattern right here. So if you have some of this left over from your Christmas card making, scrapbooking, um, this pattern and also this pattern and that pattern are great for Valentine's cards. They're red and white and with touches of light gray. So I think that's it. Oh, one last thing is I popped these up on dimensionals. So when you do that, the dimensionals are showing through. So I just use a little bit of our dazzling details to cover that up and to cover up the adhesive that was showing through too. So thanks for watching. This is Super Awesome Stamper Shirley. Bye.